A really exciting night ahead of us here at the Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Real Madrid and they take on Athletic Bilbao. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Karim Benzema, who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him here? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him, his movement is excellent, and in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. dissect the Real Madrid side Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice Carvajal starts with Ferlo Mendy in the fullback positions Toni Kroos starts with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch and operating through the middle in attack today Karim Benzema well let's run the rule over the Athletic Bilbao starting lineup. Well, it's the basic 4-4-2 formation, but played well, it can be really effective. And key to its success are the wide midfield players. They have to be fit, they need to be able to run with the ball, and they need to double up with their fullbacks. It's a really tough role for them. And so the drama begins here at the Bernabeu. Potential danger here. Could be threatening. Karim Benzema. This is Kroos. Casemiro. Modric. And they find a gap in the defence. Showing a real will to win the ball. Attacking possibilities for Real. Casemiro. Excellent passing. Benzema. Luka Modric. Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. Danny Garcia. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Preferring to go infield. A really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Tony Kroos. Casemiro. Benzema. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Now, what can they do from here? Course. Can he get them the lead? There is the goal, and you could almost see that coming. They were sitting ever deeper, and now they've really paid the price. Well, as you can see here, the build-up is patient, it's precise and penetrative, which opens up the opposition. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. In business, Real Madrid with the advantage. Oh, 
Muniain. Splendid defending from Carvajal. What can Real do from this position? Casemiro cutting the ball back. Look at Modric. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. Benzema. And a decent save. Full credit. Who can they pick out? It's not a particularly good corner there. Let's see if something comes of this. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. So on the cusp of the half-time interval and Real Madrid with a narrow lead. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen from them in this half? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Space and time for the cross. Carvajal. The ball with Luka Modric. Karim Benzema. Now Casemiro. Tony Kroos. Now they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Corner to Real as they try to press home their advantage. Trying to deliver it accurately, foiling them effectively. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. And so the drama begins here at the Bernabeu. Now, what can they do from here? Horse. There is the goal, and you could almost see that coming. They were sitting ever deeper, and now they've really paid. Benzema. And a decent save, full credit. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which... The ball moving again. Real have the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. was perfectly timed and it is going to be a corner
taken short. Garcia. And tidily played. It is to be a throw in. And he cuts inside. Teammate available. Body in the way. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Vinicius Junior. It is a decent looking attack here. But they dealt with the threat first. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. So a half an hour remaining. One it back. Garcia. Now they're on the scent of something positive. Smuggled away. Tony Kroos, Marco Asensio. The ball with Luka Modric. Here is Marco Asensio. Benzema. Crossing possibilities. Can he do it? And pushed onto the woodwork. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Well, that save has kept him in this game. They now need to create one or two chances of their own. Casemiro. Is with Vinicius Junior. Benzema. It was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Benzema. Fantastic diving save. But that ball played in rather well. Mendy. Benzema. Teammate in support. It's still alive. And thumped away. Well, that would have been game over. But unless they show more quality going forward, there's just no way back for them. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left, and just one goal between the sides. Pulls it back. Cleared away. Munyain. Oh, what a fantastic save. Well, that's a match-winning save there. Not long left now. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? Substitution for Real Madrid. He's driven in the corner. And they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Williams. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Might be able to produce from this position. And they know they need to stop him. No-nonsense clearance. 
So there goes the final whistle. Real Madrid victorious, and their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today. Now, what can they do from here? Course. There is the goal, and you could almost see that coming. They were sitting ever deeper, and now they've really paid. Benzema. And a decent save, full credit. Let's see if something comes of this. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which... And a fantastic diving save.